Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I have a quick tutorial video to teach you how you can record internal audio of your Android phone without root. So for this you'll need a PC or a laptop, a stereo cable which only comes in around 2 or 3 dollars. My laptop only has one headphone jack port, so I'll be using this adapter that lets me use both headphones and a microphone through the USB port. First we'll install the screen recorder that will allow us to record our screen and in shot to add in our audio. Both apps are completely free to download from the Play Store. I will leave a link to all of them in the description down below. We will also need Audacity on our PC, which is a free audio recording software that will allow us to record our audio. I will have it linked in the description down below along with another file which is required to export your recording in MP3. Now connect one end of the stereo cable to your phone and the other one to the microphone port of your PC or laptop. In Audacity, change the audio host to Windows Wasapi. Recording device to microphone, in my case it's USB audio since I'm using the adapter. Recording channels I have set to mono but you can set it to stereo if it allows you to. And leave the speakers as they are but change them if you see any errors when playing. Now if you start recording and play music on your phone, it will now record it on your PC. Now on your phone, launch the your screen recorder and make sure a 3 second countdown is set. Open up a game or whatever you want to record, hover your mouse over the recording button on Audacity. Right when the countdown ends, press record in Audacity. This will help us sync the audio later. Now just play your game or whatever you want to do and then just stop both recordings at the same time. And when you're done recording, go to File, Export, MP3 and send this audio recording file to your phone via Bluetooth or however you'd like. Then launch InShot on your phone and import your screen recording. Go to Music, My Music and select the recording file you send to your phone. Pull video volume all the way to zero and tap OK. Play the video and adjust the audio to make sure it's in sync. Tap the tick icon when you're done and simply export your video. If you think this is too much work, then I'd recommend spending the same amount of time rerouting your phone, voiding its warranty and simply and possibly breaking your phone. The choice is all yours. I hope this video was helpful, if it was be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more videos. Thank you so much for watching, I will see you in the next video. Peace out.